Hello everybody, how are you doing on this wonderful Sunday? Today, uh, we're playing Sleeper's Quest, a labyrinth for thee. Here is the link to the game and uh, yeah, let's hop right in. Um, I didn't even go into menu, this is just what I go, what I spawn into. And uh, I wanted to like get into a menu to uh, turn on V-Sync. Um, but if I press escape, then it quits the game. <laughs> so yeah, let's just go ahead. A checkpoint saves the location, nothing else will remain. For when you wake up from your slumber, one needs to re ascertain. While doors, chests, and checkpoints reset back to the start, yet you remain. You stay where you are. That is spooky. I I don't want my progress to stop. Can I jump up here? Is that cheese? It is over there. Oh, hello there. What the, is, is this the right way? I'm so confused, chat. Uh, but yeah, this game is on sale right now. If you want to check it out yourself, it's only 75 cents, I believe, right now. Sigil or Sigla, I'm actually not sure, I always pronounce differently, of the sleeper. Those who dream must be asleep, and asleep you are. The cradle holds the path to the dream. The dream sleeper is not far. Just had to quickly blow my nose. And, uh... Let me just double check. Yes, this game doesn't have any achievements. Oh, I see, I can sprint, actually. Upon this drop, be free like thine root. A number of paths to many, for there is only one way out. What is this? A chest? A chest for... Jesus, everything's shaking. A chest for you, it has been bestowed. No, something will change. I couldn't read the rest. <laughs> the labyrinth. Oh boy. Can we do this jump? Ha! Ah, we're cheesing the labyrinth. Ooh, what is this? The vertical force pushes one into the air, and always a perfect bounce one can expect jump on in, I dare. Oh shit! Alright, so the cheese is actually the intended strat, I believe. Oops, we couldn't... Oh jeez, these are spikes. Spacebar extra jump. They tell me this is that now. At the beginning you will end up and prepare to use what you've learned. When walk one walks into a return mirror, the magical spot is where one will return. Death awaits, hold shift or L2 to run. What? Which one, which way will you go? Wish I could jump up again. But I forgot where that was. Ah, here's another one of these lights. There are traps here, there are traps there, there are traps everywhere. <laughs> Doesn't work. Interesting. Some things over here. It seems very, like, abandoned. Most of the music is, like, so quiet. Like, it's also quiet for me, but let's turn it up for chat at least. Nothing there. Oh! What the? I got scared. You suddenly wake up. Come back, sleeper. Close your eyes. Traps here, the traps there. The did I tr did I go into a trap? I wonder. I want to go into a trap. Yeah, that's uh... when I die. I suddenly uh, I, I suddenly wake up in, in quotation marks. 
so uh, let's not die. Oh, is this the return mirror? Chance one must sometimes take, although chances are sometimes something will be fake. He blinks slowly as he gazes into the mirror. What? This is... What? I'm so confused. What? I I was like, wait, what is that sound? It only happens when I when I like jump and like fall, and then I wanted to to see what it was, but it was spikes coming out of the ground. Chance one must sometimes take, but the chances will we take. I wanna get to whatever there over the, is over there. It's so dark. Checkpoint. Oh. We came from there and I wanted to say let's go over there. But I died. Will we spawn here? Yes. That's good at least, I guess. The jumping's surprisingly good. Like, it feels... feels it, it feels good to jump, and it's pretty precise. Uh, what is wrong here? This is like a dead end, isn't it? Right, I guess let's uh, use the mirror, huh? Oh, pfft. I was too slow. Too slow! Hey, Treeman! Welcome back! Are you back from uh, vacation? Hope you're doing good. Alright, let's try to get to the main island and use the mirror. Graham, now time to buckle down and get ready for winter. Mm. Beginning you will end up. True, but what does it mean? Is something over here? Uh, exclamation mark game if you want to check this game out, by the way. Beams exist to those, find them. A crystal of green hue records. <sighs> of course, spikes would have spawned on the. I can't even read a damn thing! Ah! Uh, anyways. Freeman, do you know what games done quick is? Also known as GDQ. Your eyes okay? My eyes? Oops. <sighs> I need to be more decisive. GDQ? Nope, never heard of it. Oh boy. I'm, I'm glad I, I can introduce it to you then. Uh, GDQ, also known Games Done Quick, is a week long speedrun marathon um, where games are being. Quick. I, I, I like stood still for a second so I can ascertain there's no like spikes coming from the floor and as soon as I'm cracked with it, spikes. What the heck? And uh, yeah, different games being speedrun, um, even a lot of indie games and stuff, it just ended. Um, but I think it, it could be interesting for you. Um, because there are quite some few games, and you probably will have played at least some of them. Um, very special this year. Do you know... Did you play Ocarina of Time for the N64 when you were small? There are traps here, there are traps there, there are traps... Everywhere. Look at the ground. Yeah. 
I just interact with it instead. Alright, no more interacting. Gotcha. This is the Dark Souls of 3D platformers. <laughs> more like the uh, Kaizo Mario of... Or rather like Cat Mario of... Uh, 3D platformers. Now my N64 part racing may want to a little bit then I have to get out and get a job. Oof. That sucks. Um, oh, there's spikes coming. But I bet there's gonna be at least a few games that you played. Um, that had eventually been covered by GQ and it's super interesting. It can... doesn't work. I can highly recommend those games. And it's really interesting to just see games be fully broken. What is this? A flame? You need to get a flame somehow. It looked like a person almost, but it was just a bush. Shrub. He lies around high above the ground to test the cable and control and thus the key will be found. Alright, so we do need the bouncy pad to go up the labyrinth. It is not hidden in the labyrinth, it is hidden above the labyrinth. We just need to find the uh, jumping pad again. How's the audio, by the way? The game is pretty quiet, but that's also for me. Ah, a new checkpoint. Test one must pass to find the door, perhaps the only test, perhaps there are many more. Ouch. I was worried that the thing underneath me would vanish. Put pause at this end? Yeah, that's uh, that's great then. Yet- oh my god. I, I bonked. The atmospheric music is, I think, the most important part here. Wee, wee. Yeah, it, it disappears. If I stay on it too long, or basically, like, there's a little timer, it just disappears, but I need to wait for it to actually line up. So what the fuck? Oh, sheesh. No! I needed to get in there. This is hard. This is proper hard. Oh, what the heck? Can I even make it there? I don't think so. Can I find a way around? I don't think so. Yep, no way. I don't know if I'll be able to beat this, and I'm saying this 20 minutes in. This is legend hard. What? Nope. Oh, but I guess we respawn at the uh, checkpoint. We can try that whole thing again. That's good. Yep, this one. Oh no! Wrong momentum. Let's go over there, whatever there, that... Oh my god, what is that momentum? Oh my god. The respawn should be way past the a little bit annoying. Oh my god. Alright, the thing is there. I think we definitely like Yeah, we need the proper momentum. 
So let's go over here. And then... No! I, I basically want to get up there. I don't know if that's the right way, but I feel like I can get it if I just get the right momentum. Oh, nope, that's... If you don't get in the right cycle, you're dead, and you need to wait. Well, I just realized I should de-dust... Oh my god, I, I messed it up. I should de-dust my screen. Um, yesterday, I had this impulse to fix my life, Elmeo, oh, to impulsively fix things. I don't know if you uh, have that. Um, sometimes... Oh my god as well um but i just was like all right i gotta clean my pc and then i just de-dusted my entire pc like the uh little port at the bottom but also from the inside which was surprisingly undusty but i also i got a new vacuum recently um but that vacuum is sadly not really uh usable for cleaning like that because i need something more like finicky i guess Come on! Yes! Aha! I did it! Not a dang this game? Yep. Find thy key. Chest for you it has been bestowed. No something will change, although you will not know. Great. So something has changed? I don't know what. But we got this. Let's just jump down again and hopefully land on. Yes. Awesome. This is another bouncy pad. Wonder... Wait, it's not a bouncy pad. This is not a bouncy pad, interesting. The fog really adds to the atmos uh, mystic atmosphere. Hey, Gail. Wait, I'm gonna say hi. Because you can't hear me, because that's your identity. And if you can, and still have that identity, then shame on you. How you doing, Gail? It definitely does. It, it actually, like, there is no V-Sync, and normally that's, like, a deal-breaker for me. Um, but here it's less noticeable, I guess, because of the fog, mostly. Hmm, I wonder if this disabled the traps, you know, with the stone where we wanted to, like, talk about the hue of green or something. It always killed me if I interacted with it. I wonder if that changed something. If I press escape, then uh, the game will end. Then I'll just get booted to desktop, so that's not an option screen or something. I don't have a map right either. So it's all just my... In German we say Orientierungsinn, which is, I guess, like... Sense of direction, sense of location. Wait, did the did the whole thing change? You can't tell me this has been here before. This whole thing changed, didn't it? After cut some wood, I'll be sure to watch for your streams and drop it. Well, it's the conversation room. And it's deep, deep into NA2. Oh no, I'm after you. Let's go. Yeah, you can't be finished with that unless until I beat it, the first one. That's gonna be embarrassing. A fun chopping woods. Appropriate chopping woods. And why did my mind connect these two topics, which you will see are directly unrelated to each other? Um, it's the chop wooding simulator. Um, I've been addicted. To Car Mechanic Simulator 2018, and also Motor Bicycle. The key lies around here, but around the test okay. Okay, we found that already, though. Um, and also the uh, Bicycle Mechanic Simulator. Uh, I, I shortly bought the uh, Car Repair Simulator 2021, but I like the 2018 version more, actually. Um, do anything, huh? And yeah, I've, I've just... I've been addicted to it for some reason. 
I, I don't know why. How do I set that on fire? And like allegedly like pumped 30 hours into it. Whereas the uh, game I paid 100 bucks for, the special edition of Fire Emblem Warriors 3 Houses, I, I barely get like 15 hours in and I, I am not entirely enjoying it because the micromanagement in the game is atrocious. There's just so much. You know, I, I bought a Warriors game to play a Warriors game, right? But there's just so, so much you'd have to do between each battle. You get like a battle of seven minutes and then you just... What the hell? Not this... Gee, thanks. Thanks. <laughs> um, like you, you have this this battle of seven minutes and then you need to go back. Oh, Jesus. Because you need to upgrade this and upgrade that and you can upgrade this and that. And you need to listen to support conversations. The real finish about constantly going down the rabbit hole is slowing you down. I am 100%ing the game! That is the Palix 00 guarantee, which is actually not a guarantee because I dropped quite some TP games now. But my new guarantee is I'm gonna 100% the games that I like. Or most of them, I guess. Is this? No, I thought this was maybe the thing where we could bounce on the pad with the rotating thing again. But I don't think so. Oh, actually it is! Oh my god, my sense of direction is unrivaled. Oh, and I'm dead. You know, I could have just killed myself, except, wait, I couldn't, because I didn't find any traps or whatever. But I want to get over to the other side now, is basically what I'm saying. Nope. And once I start falling, I can't uh, jump up. Oh god, that was close. Alright. Oh, come on! That was... that was not fair. You get so much promise of reason writing. You mean, I'm gonna 100% every game I like? You just watch. I... I have... Like, done 200 cats fights in Yakuza 0. Even though it's literally rock, paper, scissors, but with girls, don't ask, please don't ask, um, for so many just to get 10 wins because it's complete RNG. I, I, it was just, oh. And like, I'm, I'm, I have considered paying a Mahjong player to complete the Mahjong minigames in Yakuza for me. Because that was what holding was what holding me back from uh, from one hundred percenting. Oh no no! Please come on! Oh, I messed it up. What? Twice? I wish this was a little bit faster, and with a little bit I mean by a lot. Phew. No, I... I forgot they would disappear under me! <laughs> Okay, once I'm in the middle, I need to recalculate my, my strategy. Jump. Oh my god. <sighs> See ya, Dreamon. Thanks for stopping by. Yep, that was messed up. <sighs> I messed that one up. <laughs> And now. Oh my god, I didn't even make the second jump. What is this? Jump King accepted 3D? Oh, 
Oh, come on. All right, let's go into gamer mode. I have, oh my God. I've repositioned my uh, armrests on my chair. So my, my elbows are above my hands. This means that all of them, like the, the, uh, the, the blood will flow from the elbows to my hands and does give me gamer reflexes. Are you ready for those gamer reflexes, chat? Game. All right, we come pretty close to this one. No way we're gonna in hell we're gonna make this one. So we just need to be fast. Oh my god. I got another idea actually. Oh my god, why did I not consider it before? I have a very interesting idea which is definitely cheese, but I think it might work. Right, Chad, are you prepared? No, 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 no! Oh, I tried to land on the wall so I could literally just pick the wall to where I needed to go. And not do this stupid thing. And like, this is a little, like, there's a little edge so you can't, like, jump off at the last possible thing. L a little bit of coyote time. No, you just, uh, you just jump from standing. Oh my god, I'm doing it! Chat! I did it! Please don't kill me now. Don't kill me. What is over here? Nothing. Oh, I'm so worried about the spikes coming from the ground. I listen intently and close. Because if I hear that thwop sound, then I should not stop. Don't stop till you drop. I'm not even sure what we are looking for. My two things that I think I'm looking for is A, a flame, so we can light up that torch that we found. If we can find it again, that is. And B, an exit. <laughs> God, I should have made a map of this place. Go here. So much, I swear to God. The thing is, I think these are in like chunks. Like basically squares. So I think a map would actually be doable. If I got like a little or a big sheet. Wait, have we been here before? I feel like, we... oh my god, there's the checkpoint. That's good. I feel like we've been there before. Lol, this is just leading itself. itself. That's kind of funny. Alright, let's go this way then, I guess. The heck? Game's messing with me. How the heck am I supposed to go back? Hopefully I took that checkpoint, otherwise I would have been screwed. I'm thinking of how I could make a, um... 
there is a good way to do it. I think I've been here before. I think I've been in a place there before. The map... I feel like spaces are overlapping, though. Oh, that's... something over there. Those walls are way higher than the rest of the labyrinth. Oh my god, it's a dead end. I think I know this music from somewhere, but I'm not sure from where. Hey, Akkad, how you doing? How was Final Fantasy? Welcome to me getting lost. Yeah, same. <laughs> uh, this is... A sleeper's quest, the labyrinth to be. Um, it is. Oh. Oh no! I need a key. No. I have no idea where to find. No! Don't you dare! Don't you dare take me back there. Um, I don't want to go there. Uh, it, it's described as a precision platformer, but I feel like it's a labyrinth simulator. It's on sale and it's pretty cheap to That's good to hear. Um, oh. What the heck? Have you ever made like a map for a labyrinth for any game? Like, I feel like it was standard back in the day to make, like, a map for Zelda 1 or something when you were a kid. But I grew up past that time frame. I feel like I should make a map for this, but I don't know what the best way to do to go about that. Oh my god, where is anything? We found a couple of spots of... We're here? What? How? What? No. What? We managed to get a... Find a couple of interesting spots of interest, but I think we need something for that. Um... And I have no idea what this. I just had a glance, so if there's an actual labyrinth game, we need to find a way, the way with puzzles. Action. Yeah, it's... I, I thought it would have been like more platformy, action-y like. But it's basically a labyrinth. We're in a dream, so this is a dream. When we die, we wake up, but we need to go back to sleep. <laughs> um, And we're supposed to find stuff, TM. Interesting. Let's activate this checkpoint then. And we need to... I, I'm not even sure what the goal is. Escape the labyrinth? Oh, this is... This is bad end. The bad dead end. So there's only one way to go for this. And uh, occasionally there's some platform sections strewn in. Managed to find something in another thing. So we found a total of two chests. And they unlocked something, but the thing is, the game doesn't tell you what they unlocked. It literally says, oh yeah, this unlocked something. Alas, you don't know where. Games are a great team, but don't always well performed. So excited to see how this goes. Glad to see that you're uh, glad to hear that you're excited, then. If you have any idea on where to go, then let me know. But, uh, what was kind of striking is this thing here. This is a big, 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 big tower. And, uh, wait, where's the key? This was where the key was, right? You wanted a key here, right? I made it this far, why stop now? Keep moving forward and you'll find the dream somehow. Wait, this was not the section I was before? Wait, my chat overlay froze. Oh my god, I cannot tap... I closed the game. 
Aí. This is a tragedy. All right, I, I remade the chat. Thank you for, for notifying me. Um, I, I couldn't tap out of the game. So I pressed escape. But the thing is, escape actually, like, just closes the game. And uh, you continue as, at your last checkpoint. But every chest and st stuff you opened locks again, as far as I know. So that sucks. Um, can you write something? I, I raised up the chat box. Hopefully that fixed it. People moving forward and find the dream somehow. I guess we could check if the chests actually reset with... Uh, if we find that little gap there again. Like the gap with the platform inside. Because there was a bouncy pad and with that bouncy pad we could go to a chest that it was in the sky. We definitely opened the chest, so if that chest is still open, great, we didn't lose any progress. If that chat, however, is close, then my god. Just start at square one. Don't know if I can survive that mentally. That's the end. I would be so lost. I am also lost. You're saying this like I am not lost. Fuck. It kind of has something of a horror game, right? But I'm not being scared, which is a good thing. You're taking it really well. Am I? I feel like I'm losing my sanity. <laughs> I have like a slight sense of direction of where certain things are, but the little things, you know, like the uh, left, right, whatever, and the little dead ends is beyond me. I think we're closing in on the section I want to get into, though. Thing behind this corner? Oh my god, I was right! This is where I wanted to be. I cannot get back there, can I? Oh no. Oh no, I can't. Because I need to have that lined up and there's this whole way I need to get back through. Oh god, let's see if there's a checkpoint nearby. I played Labyrinth with friends who was scared along and chased with my skeleton zombie things. Oh, what a mood. Uh, recently I played one round, in numbers, one round of Phasmophobia. I slept afterwards and had a nightmare. From one round of Phasma. This is... A dead end! My old Minecraft instincts are coming in, always jump. This jumping is like one frame faster or something. I wonder if I can bug myself up there with stone, but I don't think so. I don't think we have been here before. Asmus pretends it took me many runs until I finally left the van. Ah, Did you play with friends? They went inside and you simply went uh, stayed in the van. That's so cute. I just had no idea what was going on. Like, I, I knew I was expected of, like, and ghosts and whatever. And I died in my first ever run. It's kind of funny because the, uh, the friend I was playing with said, Oh yeah, I don't expect anyone to die. Um, but, like, I'm more confused than scared in Phasmo. At least on the conscious level. Because I have no idea how to do certain things. 
like the, I, I played the tutorial afterwards and the tutorial didn't really explain things better than my friend with uh, the dynamics that in peace so something i oh this is here Let's see something uh um let's go to the left i guess Oh, what is this? Some walls are walls, some walls are not. Some walls stand still, some walls are not what you th Are you kidding me? Do I really need to hack all walls because one of them might be a thing? Like, fake? Are you kidding me? Because some walls are moving because these look very movable. Oh my god, I hate this. I, I feel like they should have indicated some of the walls being... Or something. Now we're gonna hug it every single. I'm happy we do this. Also, yeah, these stay. These stay down once they're down, though. Wait, wait, look behind me. Wait, what? Those platforms didn't disappear? What the heck? If I stand on them, they disappear. That's messed up. Some low poly crack on them that would go exactly. Hasma always had a big love to love those stuff, but I'm also terrified. And difficulty ceiling. Did you say it has a high difficulty ceiling? I feel like the, uh, the difficulty ceiling is capped at the uh, difficulty floor, so like the, the minimum knowledge to actually enjoy the game. It's quite high. Oh, by the way, I didn't know... What is this? No, not this again. Why would you want me to lead me back there, huh? Why? What What did I do? That's the beginning of the labyrinth. Who would I want to go there? Um, I don't know. I guess I need to go there. Uh, I don't know if you've been following GDQ, but there was actually a plasma uh, run. Um, on there, so literally a Phasmophobia speedrun. I don't know how I... I played on, like, Amateur, and I died. Can I... Okay. Link slowly as games. Oh, if you haven't watched yet, um, you should definitely, um... Watch the what is it called? Uh, Ocarina of Time uh, beta showcase. Oh, it's beta, really, Re right? Like that's how you pronounce that. I'm always like, I have problem with pronouncing that word because in German it's beta. Um, so I assume it's in English. It's like. Eater or something. But if that also sounds wrong. The traps here, the traps there, the traps everywhere. They are. Oh my god. That is. In any of the styles and categories. But this wasn't a speedrun. This was a showcase of the uh, beta of Ocarina of Time. Because basically, on uh, the 1.0 version of the cartridge, um, there were some things left over from development. <sighs> yeah, that also happened in the game, by the way. Beta? Alright. Yeah, I'm always in trouble with that. Um, although, I guess I don't pronounce Alpha Elfe or something, so I should have just, you know. So this is the same here. A chance one must sometimes take so the chances of something will be fake. You're winning big for when the way to supply the What the fuck? Huh? What the fuck is this? What the fuck is that? And what is that? I am molding. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. 
Ah, this is this here, I see. I want this. Uh, can I not go back? Oh, I see here. Um, I wonder why that section in particular is dark. Oh yeah, I didn't did already flip that switch. Um, so there's a fake wall somewhere in here, right? That's what they're saying. They just need to hug every wall, huh? That kind of sucks. Not gonna lie. Or is <sighs> what was that? I just died for some reason. Alright, we're here and it like shows me to this section and I think what the hint is trying to tell me is something here is fake. Oh my god. Yeah, sometimes it just spikes from the ground come up when you walk for some reason. And uh, yeah, so so some things are left on the 1.0 cartridge, and uh, you just need to access them. So what they did was um, use uh, custom uh, arbitrary code execution, which means that uh, you can basically program the game to do whatever you want it to do. Um, and with that, they enable the things that were on the cartridge. Um, so they kind of showcase what the beta, beta, beta um, of Ocarina of Time looked like before it was released. What the fuck is... A vertical fall is perfectly effective and always the same strings from a different perspective. Oh my god. Oh god, I'm, I'm platforming so hard out of my mind right now. What? No, don't you dare. I wonder if I could just make that jump. I'm scared. <laughs> well, at least I'm on this thing. But if I don't fall over, I can just navigate more freely. Throw up. Oh my god. I'm so done. Let's try to find wherever that was. If I could kill myself right now, that would be great, because then I would respawn at the checkpoint, and I think I know where to go from there, but alas, the end. Because the game only kills me when it wants me to, and not when I want to kill me. Is this... Did you hear that whoop? There was spikes coming out of the ground. Hey, horsey, how you doing? What is this? Hold shift or left trigger to run. I, this was the beginning of the of the uh, labyrinth, I think. Crystal of Green Hue records one place when death brings. Oh my god! That is the spikes that we saw. The traps here, there are traps there, there are traps over there. This is the beginning of the labyrinth. Yep. You'll end up and prepare to use what you want up in the melee connection as well. Oh, this is here. I think what I'm meant to do is now find the fake wall, and it's somewhere here. Which way will you go? The fake wall must be somewhere here. Oh! That's the spikes! That's the spikes! Was there a trap indicated? No. A lot of Elder Scrolls Online, that's awesome. This whole game is basically Cat Mario. If, if that old drum pack says something.
least I found this section again you know, now that I died, so let's uh Don't you dare. Let's try to find it. Uh, let's try to find more. What is that blue hue over there? Oh my god, no. Thank goodness. No! Alright, like this. Don't really think I have air control. Or maybe only when, uh, uh, like, going up. Okay, this one will, like, give me a small bounce, which is meant to fake me out. So I will not fall victim to that. This one is also a small bounce, I believe. Yep. So let's try to get... Get below there! Oh, yes, yes, yes. <laughs> We don't talk about this. We, we don't talk, talk about this. Ah, my god. And now I am in a place, and I don't know where, and uh, I don't have a map, I don't know a way to kill myself. Uh, this game is called The Sleeper's Quest, and we're in a dream, and it's a hardcore platform, at least that's what it's subscribed to. And, uh, yeah, we need to navigate through the labyrinth and find the secrets and navigate some pretty fucking mean obstacles. It's also 75% uh, off right now. Check it out. It's a game. <laughs> Hugging the walls to see if there's a fake. Hey, we found this again. Nice. Didn't think we could reach that. Ah. wonder what's over there, though. What do you think? And I want to go whatever that is. Alright. Trial 55. No! Rip. Wonder if there's any guy. There was spikes coming from the ground. Thing about dreams. I think I'm going the wrong way if I want to get back to that thing, but I think also we will go to that section with the circles. Where we could check if the chest was still open. Circular platform. Would be around here somewhere if I think if I am right in which spot I am. Oh my god, I'm so good! How do I have that? Jeez, I'm not gonna save this one though. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Oh my god, I don't know how I survived. Nice! Yep, that closed again. See, a chest for you has been bestowed, no something would change, all you will not know. So something has changed, and I don't know what, and we found another chest already. And, uh, yeah, that, uh, that all kind of sucked. So this thing could also make me jump, right? But it doesn't. I think this is what we activated. So we need to, like, find more tests or whatever to activate this thing because this looks pretty important
I think in near here is gonna be the uh, is gonna be the other jump platform. If this is the first one. So, so that's like a thing I I actually don't like about the game. If you exit the game, so if you just accidentally hit escape or uh, if your cat goes over it or just want to take a break then all your progress will be lost you will still be at the same checkpoint but all the chests you opened are gonna be closed again that's something i just can't agree with not everyone is trying to play games all the time or for hours at a time I think I've been at this section particularly only once. I kind of want to try to get up here. But no. That cat blame not taking that slander. Hey, tell me your cat never went over your keyboard and pressed something that uh, he didn't want them to press. You're under oath. Daily. See? Q E D. And the Q stands for cued. Yes, I write queued with a Q. What the fuck is this? I've never been here. Huh? How do I get up there? What? That's impossible. Exactly. I am lost. Like, usually I have a slight sense of where I am. But right now I'm completely lost. I don't even... I'm not even... Look at the things, the palisades, they come. Not this... Uh, fuck you. Don't stop, don't stop. You want to see them come? Yep. But I, I, I remember that sign, I also remember this grass, but I don't know where to go from here. I both the Grand Test of Keepers and plus the Keyword Grand. I did find the key. So now I just need to find the keyhole. Was it that one space that was near the tower? How do I get to that? This game would be infinitely better with a map. <laughs> It's like a regenerating map. It can be even like collectible you could find within a maze. It could actually be in the game already, but I wouldn't know if you find it. Oof da. I got over the how did I come out here? Huh? Let's try it this way. I don't think I've been here. I'm here? Huh? What the fuck? I'm so lost. Oh my god, I'm so lost. Like, uh, if the labyrinth was removed and was only the puzzle pieces, so like, where you can find something and where you need to go to do something, then I think I might have, have a chance. But this way, nah. -uh. No way. What is this? What will it kill me? 
But all mirrors are the same. Some somewhere you'll end up familiar and you just don't go insane. Are you kidding me? So some of the backwards mirrors are telling me they will take me backwards, but instead they will actually take me something new. Um, I guess I need to take every uh, backwards mirror that I find now. Interesting that they have these knowledge checkpoints, if that makes sense. It's the term in a Mario Maker community, at least. Patrol levels. Um, which I feel very much a need to make a comparison to. What's your goal? Good question. I can't tell you. Uh, we're in a dream. Their goal is to wake up. But whenever we die, we just go to sleep again. So I assume it's finding the exit. I assume it has something to do with the uh, little stone tablet thing with the blue markers on it. We find a second chest and a second keyhole. Are the horrors that you must escape or just this maze? Um far as we have seen, only this maze right now. We got a short introduction to uh, platforming. And then we have voluntarily, which was a stupid idea, uh, jumped into this maze. I don't know if I came from the right or left, so let's just hope for the best. Was there no of this? Dude, there's no jump scares or anything in this game, as far as I can tell. You know the general maze walking rule, always like go right, like hug one of the walls. But that only walks, uh, works with some mazes. I don't think this will work with this uh, maze, as one of the elements of this maze is jumping pads that will get us above the map. Um, and then... Uh, but what are you doing? Hey, I'm doing the right... Um, Alright, I'll follow your thing and only follow the right route. Uh, that will get us above the thing and then leave us in new positions and this is where we have been so let's just hop the right wall then i should probably also like just hug the wall because one of these walls apparently is fake. At least if what one of the tablets told us it was to believe to. Uh, and also interpreted. How do you know one is fake? Uh, one of the tablets said... Uh, not everything is what it seems, and something with walls. I don't quite remember it, but we basically find that the wall might be fake. It, I think it also said something about the beginning of the little maze. Um, so it might be in the beginning of the maze. Yeah, now. What now, huh, horse? Now, what now? No, I get it. Oh my god, nope! And... That whole right, the whole dried thing, now it's gone. Because <laughs> now we're here, which is actually the beginning of the maze. I'm gonna hold right here. Oh, yeah, this thing for some reason. <sighs> Do it again. I want to 
gonna take that big mirror because I assumed it would just bring me back to the same spot because that's what it indicates. But we also learned that these might be fakes. Chances are sometimes fake. Nope, this is exactly where it brought. Death awaits. Oh my god. How do you know which one to fake? We don't. We don't know. There is no way to discern them. <laughs> At least we couldn't find one. But I think this uh, chat, this is a good time to call it for this game. Uh, I showed you a good way to do this. Um, so if you want to check out the game yourself and also check if you perchance could actually get through the maze, and I would honestly be extremely surprised uh, because that's a feat, that's a real feat. Uh, then check it out for yourself. It currently is 75% uh, off, if I remember correctly. Let me just check. Yes, so it only costs around 50 cents. That is a deal, chat. That is an absolute deal. Um, let's see do we yes i think i know what you which game to switch to ending already no we're not ending the stream we're switching games <laughs>